do you understand that you um in, in response as opposed to the coronavirus pandemic and uh, all of the challenges uh, you decided to kind of go online uh, can you tell me more about that I, I I always had a gallery uh, website uh, when I opened up the art gallery, um, but I found that this year because we were in lockdown, um, I needed to I needed to go basically to more e-commerce uh, so that people could actually uh, buy the art online. So I uh, moved over to the Shopify platform. And a friend of mine helped me set that up. And so basically, my old website would have been just, you know, you show the art and that's it. Now with the, the new website, um, which was a big job now, but I had plenty of time during the lockdown to populate it with all the art. So now you can click and buy and post it out directly and, you know, pay you know, by PayPal or credit card and all of that. So, so it just gives people the opportunity to buy online <clears throat> uh, rather than uh, coming into the gallery. Having said that, a lot of people, and, I, and I, I'd be kind of one of these people, I like to see it in real life before before I buy it, but it just gives people in, I don't know, in Australia or in America or wherever outside the world, that chance to be able to buy. And it's just, it's the way we're going. I think all of the, uh, the retailers, uh, whether you're an art gallery or any retailer, you need to have uh, e-commerce, you need to have uh, a website where people can purchase directly, you know. What's the name of your website? So the, the website, <clears throat> it's uh, balaban, www.balaban.net. That's B-A-L-L-A-B-A-N.net. And uh, so what I'm doing is free, wor- free worldwide shipping as well. So uh, if somebody goes on, they see something you like, you know, it, it's, it's free anywhere in the world um, to post. And uh, also do deliveries all over Ireland as well. So it's yeah. great. It's important also to support the arts at this time because <laughs> it's very challenging. It is. It certainly is. That is. It's a tough time. And I, I do think, because uh, I, I would know quite a lot of artists, and it, it's a struggle, particularly uh, that all the art fairs are, were cancelled this year. And, you know, galleries are all closed. So for individual artists, it, it is a, it's a very tough time. Um, but I do believe that the art, the art market will pick up again. Um, I think people, particularly during the lockdown, people have had more time in their homes and a lot of people have got uh, their house, you know, maybe interior designer, they've got, uh, you know, worked on their house and they want to get uh, some new art or whatever. So I've actually found that there's more people buying art than, you know, tr- through the website uh, than before. So, you know, they, they kind of people realize, well, I have a bit more money, I'm not going on holidays this year, I'm not going out for a restaurant for a meal, you know. Uh, I'll, I'll treat myself to a, a nice painting or a picture, you know, a print or whatever. So, so it's kind of, it's not, you know, it's not all that bad, you know. Uh, but having said that, there's, it, it's, I recognize the, the struggles and difficulties a lot of artists are going through. But we'll, we'll get through it.